Hello everybody, and welcome to, well, what's probably going to be my first OU battle of the series, and depending on if I win, well, you may get to see more, because I'm in a, well, the Poke Beach monthly OU tournament, and I'm facing off against my first opponent, so without further ado, let's get started. I'm going to start with Wishmaker the Jirachi. And my opponent's going to start out with Lopany. I'm pretty sure it's going to Mega Evolve. Okay, this is recorded live, so yeah. Here we go. Mega Fake Out, as expected. The thing that's scaring me is the Clefable, because let's be honest, who isn't scared of a Clefable? They sent out Wasp Rotom, I cannot Thunder Wave that, so... I am predicting an electric type move, so I'm going to go into Hungry the Hippowdon. Was I right? No, they just went for a Will O Wisp. So, yeah, Earthquake's going to do almost nothing. But all I have to do with Hungry is set up Stealth Rocks and then Roar and constantly send out some other stuff, which is important. So, yeah, not really much to say while well, my opponent's thinking. They're going to go into Celebi, and because the Sandstorm's up, I'm predicting a Grass Attack, so I would go into my Charizard, but um, I'm going to go into Duck the Porygon, too, because it's a wall. It can be very wally, especially if it's a special wall. Duck is a special wall, so yeah. Still, I'm very scared of that Clefable. <laughs> I need to keep Jirachi around for it. And Download gets my special attack. They're just going to Baton Pass out of there. I'm predicting the switch back into Lopany, which is really the sensible thing to do here. Or, well, Seeing as I'm not a physical wall. No, they're going to go straight into Heatran. Which means that... You know what? Let's be a bit evil. I'm going to just go for a Magic Coat to start this off. <laughs> Bounce their taunt right back. Which means now they're either going to have to attack or switch out. They go for Lava Plume, but I'm a special... Come on! Is that really fair? Well, as I was saying, I am a special wall, but now I'm going to need to switch out. Why did I go for Charizard there? Um, let's go back into Hip Out On. And yeah, not really much to say. They go into Blanderous. Please tell me I didn't go up. Okay, good. I actually registered the switch into Hip Out On. Which means I can roar. And just kind of damage some stuff with Stealth Rocks. And Heatran's back. Heatran does not want to take the inevitable ground attack. He's going to protect. Now, now I'm predicting a switch into either Wash Rotom or Landorus. Most likely Wash Rotom, since I am weak to water. Or no, they go into Landorus. So I'm just going to roar, bring out Lopany, kind of just get some chip damage off. And yeah, not really else much to say. They go for the fake out. And yeah, Hungry will go down here. I'm going to switch into Amber the Gardevoir. And I, this may seem like madness, but I do have a choice scarf, so... I'm hopefully going out speed and go into the moon blast. They're just going to retreat and I'm going to do absolutely nothing. So I'm going to switch back into duck because I have no clue what my opponent's going to try and do here. They're going to try and toxic. Is this a toxic stalling heatran? Is that even a thing? 
Oh. Amber does carry a nasty surprise and focus blast, so perhaps I can get off a focus blast. But for now, I'm just going to get some chip damage off of Duck. And yeah, I'm kind of just waiting for a good opportunity to switch into maybe Dragonite. And their turn to go into Selby. I'm going to go for the try attack. Again, does not do much. Um, I have no... I'm just... Should I go... No, I'm going to Toxic. And, yeah. They go for a sword stance. I miss completely. Alright, now I'm predicting a Pajan Pass, so I'm going to switch into Angreg and the Dragonite. A, do a baton, or it's a sword stance seed bomb. A sword stance seed bomb Celebi. Off of, well, it does have 100, 100, 100, 100, 100. So I can see that working. Now that they did that, well, actually, crap, are they going to go into Landorus? Please don't. They're probably going to go into Landorus. Or maybe Lopany. No, Landers. Yep. And Dragon Dance. But he does Intimidate. And seeing as it's just... It's a Scarfed one, most likely. I'm going to go for Extreme Speed. Do almost nothing and get Stone Edged and pay for it. And now I wonder what to do with my life. <laughs> um... The only thing I can think of is since he's scarfed, he can't, he's, ha he can't, well, Wishmaker resist this. Which means he's going to have to switch straight into Wash Rotom. Okay, I think I'm faster, so, um, let's go for Zen Headbutt again. Yep. Now my strategy, do that. <laughs> Just flinch with ro just flinch with Wishmaker since I can't paralyze. No, 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 no. That ended horribly. Oh well. I will finish off Rotom Wash, which means it only took me. Both of them were by the Landorus, I think. Right. Oh great, here we go. For those of you who don't know. All two of you at this point. What Clefable does is it basically just sits there and calm minds in your face. Except this one's being a bit more offensive. And my only hope is to get a bit of paraflinch off. Since Clefable's stats, Selby is straight 100s in his OU, so that says something. Jirachi is straight 100s in his OU. Clefable doesn't have a single stat over 100, and it's one of the best Pokemon outside of the Uber tier. <laughs> Which kind of says something. But yeah, they're going to switch out for Heatran. And at this point, I'm pretty sure Wishmaker's going down, so... Yeah, even with Leftovers, I think I'll die this turn. So I'm just going to Thunder Wave Heatran. Or they're going to protect and laugh in my face. How dare you. But I live. So now I'm just going to Thunder Wave this Heatran. Dang it. <sighs> Sorry, Wishmaker. <laughs> and what to do now? I guess I'll go into Charizard. And then make a heat wave. Oh, so close, so close. Well, that worked. Now, I'm going to Solar Beam just because it has 100 accuracy. And, yeah. I guess I can't really switch Charizard out at this point, seeing as there's these awful stealth rocks. Landorus is going to come in, though, and is going to use Stone Edge and take Charizard out. 
by Charizard. Right. Now, Duck's low on HP. Duck will probably die. Amber is most likely slower and will most likely die. Um, Duck, it's up to you. Crap. I did not actually come to think of it. Duck's probably dead. That was a dumb idea. But, oh wait, no, Duck lives. And tri -Attack takes out this monster known as Landorus Therian, but Duck also dies. So now I have to choose my moves carefully. Because, again, I do pack Focus Blast, but I'm Choice Scarfed. Which could actually be really helpful here. Focus Blast, fighting doesn't resist fighting. Fake, oh, uh, that's a lot of fake out. Fighting doesn't resist fighting. They switch into Heatran. Alright, I can live with that. Whoa, not much, not much at all. Oops. So, yeah, I think I lost this, unless Amber can pull something crazy out. Because Focus Blast has 8 PP, which means I'm going to be stuck struggling for a bit. And they go into Celebi. And, yeah, that's pretty much it. Good game. And, yeah, I'd need a miracle to pull this... Nope, that is literally it. I'm just... Are you... Wait, is he going to be obnoxious and struggle? No, they're going to attack. And again, wow, that did a lot. So, good game. That's it. I lost. Thanks for watching. It was closer than it looked, but not that close. And I'll see you all next time.